Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a plan with me for January 1st to the 7th and it is the first week of 2018 and the first official week here in my new Erin Condren. Um, those of you who have been watching know that I've been planning on a happy planner and of, although I love the happy planner, um, I decided to give the Erin Condren a go this year. So hopefully I enjoy it just as much. Uh, today we are going to be planning with Firefly Paper Shop and it is her New Year's kit and these are her full boxes. There's functional sheet, the full check boxes, uh, headers and half boxes, littles, date covers, uh, more checklists, icons, sidebar, and bottom washi with regular washi. And then I also decided to pull in, uh, we might be using these guys, they're from Rose Colored Days. Um, and it's just very beautiful headers. And I think these she sold during like Thanksgiving week or something like that. Um, I'm not sure she, if she still has some. But either way, her stuff is so beautiful. Anyways, I think let's get to it. Today, we I, I do want to start off with, it's going to be a very complete spread today. So, date covers, checklist, everything, the whole shebang we will be using because it, it is a very full kit. So today, right now, we are going to start with some date covers. And this is my first time ever Doing date covers on the Erin Condren. Oh my god. So excited. I'm very excited. So, number one. We're just putting down these stickers for right now. Um, what's exciting is I'm actually filming this during. It is Sunday today, Sunday night, so it's New Year's Eve. It's around 7 o'clock, so we're not quite there yet. Still waiting around for the new year, but... Um, I'm just going to spend it here with my family. Don't really have other plans other than that. Um... And because the next day, so at the first, we are actually going to Disneyland. And because it is my aunt's birthday and she's spending the holidays with us, we decided to do something quite different this year. So Disneyland it is for the first. And these stickers are going down quite off. But don't want to spend too much time on making them look perfect so we're gonna move here oh my god I'm so excited first box first sticker on the Erin Condren and I'm already off because that January is not being covered okay good thing is these stickers come up quite well, so... Perfect! Yay! First sticker, down! <laughs> you guys are probably like, okay, this is too much. Girl, it's just a planner. <laughs> But I've been waiting so long to use this. I've had this planner just sitting there for like two months or like more than that I feel. Probably like three, four months just sitting. And I haven't been able to use it until today. So I'm super excited. Wednesday, Thursday. Oh, 
I kind of want to get this done before New Year. So usually plan with me don't take me, they take me roughly like an hour to do. So I'll definitely have time to finish getting ready and stuff. I'm like semi ready, not completely. For to bring in the new year, so. That's that, and then I want to use these little headers right below it. I hope you guys can see these headers. They're so beautiful. And I know she comes. This kit comes with a. Uh, It comes with like to-do headers and stuff. But I wanted to use these instead. <laughs> this is, I just thought this what these headers would go so nicely with this kit. So might as well. You know? And pretty. Yeah, I like how that looks. I'm like curious to see if this coil really gets like bothers me. It gets annoying after a while. <laughs> because with the happy planner, I didn't have to deal with the coil because you just remove the sheets and you can plan just on the sheets alone. But I am also noticing that the coil because I can't remove the sheets I'm kind of staying like straight while with the happy planner I would move that page around while I was editing I was like oh my god like why do I move this page so much it's like sideways and we're planning sideways oh god so noticing because it's an actual book now I can't really move it like sideways and still be in frame so that's a plus I guess <laughs> So pretty. Okay, and then we just decided to put down check boxes because it is gonna be a full spread. Very full. I love this kit. I was actually thinking about using like uh, I think it was Nicole Alexia Designs New Year's kit and it was like this beautiful purple and I did purchase it. Um, I hauled it as well so you guys should probably be in one of my videos. But it was so beautiful. I was going to use it and then Fireflox Paper Shop came out with this, this, this kit and I was just like in such awe that I decided that the Colexia's kit I'll be using another day just because her kit is very it doesn't say 2018 nowhere in the kit so you could even use it for like it doesn't necessarily have to be for New Year's it could be used for any very festive event so that's what I just decided I'll just be using that kit for something like that and this kit was gonna be used for New Year's I don't know how I'm gonna. If you guys have been watching me f for a while now, you guys know that I like using washi tape on my, like, in my spreads. And I'm not sure. I haven't quite figured out how I'm gonna incorporate washi in the Erin Condren quite yet. Um, it'll probably be for next week or something. 
um, this week I haven't, I decided not to. Just because I want to keep it clean and it is the first week on the Erin Condren, so I just want to get used to it. Um, I just want to get used to, I guess, a layout without washi for now. And then we'll figure out layouts with washi later. <laughs> and then I want to put a header at the top. Okay, and then for sidebar, we are doing this week. Let me put another header down first. I do like these headers. Ah, I'm excited, guys. I'm finally in the Erin Condren. <laughs> And I've been thinking of actually um, starting like a memory kind of plan planner. I don't know if I would film something like that. But and I was thinking about using like a Foxy Fix, uh, like a B6. I think they're called B6. I'm not very familiar with Foxy Fix lingo. <laughs> but I was thinking about using that kind of planner just for memory planning you know it'll be kind of like a scrapbook kind of thing but I'm not 100% sure on it yet I haven't decided completely if I want to do that because the fuck fixes are pretty expensive I think for a planner I know I just spent like Erin Condren's are like 80 they run you like $60 or like $80 I'm not sure how much I spent for this uh, I'm looking for oh here they are I was looking for the habit trackers. And, but the Foxy Fix that I want to get, I would like it ring bound. And I looked it up the other day and they were like 165 for ring bound. Like, you know, B6, I think it is. Oh, that was, that was too much. <laughs> I don't know. I would have to for sure, like, I would spend the money, but I would need to be certain that that's what I want to do, that that's exactly, um, I don't know, it is, let me move you guys, you know, it's something that I'm going to keep up with, not just, oh, let me just try it out, spend 160 and just, oh, no, didn't like it. And then it's like well, money wasted, get me? Like it needs to be a for certain thing that this is exactly what I want to do and then I'll spend the money on something like that. Because I do think they're worth it. If you do like planning um, in one of those planners, then it's worth it. Just like the Erin Condren, like we love planning and the stickers and everything about it. So we purchased Erin Condren's because that's what we like. So it's something like that. I feel. Uh, for New Year's, do we want to put the clock? Should we put the little dresses or the shoes? I kind of want to start off with the shoes. So New Year's will have little shoes, but I have quite a bit of things happening. I have quite a bit of things happening New Year's Day, so I might, I probably, I'll be fine. I think I'll be happy covering up this clock, it's fine. So let me put down a header today, two day headers. About this. Let's put this clock down. Like I said, I'm figuring out the sizing of 
this planner. So I don't know exactly where these headers have to go down. And yeah. Okay, so first I need to put down these full boxes. Okay. Mm. We'll do... They're all so beautiful, I'm for sure. I know I'm gonna use them all. <laughs> I don't have quite a lot of things to do on Tuesday. It is just a full work day. Um, then we'll put down the shoes. As well as Wednesday, I feel like Wednesday is a little bit more um, planner related stuff. We'll be doing this day, catching up. We're still playing catch up, guys. Uh, last week's video, plan with me video has not gone up yet, but it will. It will be going up. Hmm. Uh, either today, sometime today, or Tuesday. Because Monday, uh, like I said, Monday I'm going to Disneyland, so I won't have time. So far, I like this planner. <laughs> I'm very happy with my decision of switching. What's funny, guys, is that I actually bought a happy planner for this year, 2018, just in case I didn't like this planner. Um, and they weren't, they were, it wasn't expensive because uh, Michael's was having their sale, 40% off, 60% off planner sale that happens. And I actually bought, it was like a 2017 to, 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 to 2018 planner. So it starts like mid-year 2017. And what I was planning on doing was just, and it's what I did with, my la with last year's planner. I just removed half the year that I wasn't going to be using that no longer applied. And I just did that and I had so much space and the planner turned out pretty well because I, you know how with all the stickers and stuff, these planners get fat and chunky and well, it worked out because I had so much space that now it's like, it fits perfectly like at the end of the year, I'm looking at my planner now. It's right here. It's like to the side of me right now and I'm looking at it and it looks perfect. Here, I'll, I, can, I can show you guys. Like I had removed, I had removed half of the year and this is how it looks. See what I mean? It just, it fits perfectly in the rings with all these stickers that we obviously put in. Um, and I'm also thinking of doing like a little flip through of this. I just don't know when exactly that will be happening. Especially since we're playing catch up all this week. So we'll see. Finally, we're done with the headers. Oh my god, I love it so far. And then now we just need bottom washing, you guys. Let's see how this is going to go down. exactly how like I said I'm getting used to this Erin Condren 
so I'm not sure like spacing wise where this washi has to go down but for this week I guess it's going down there just like that uh, not too bad still okay oh. next washi Nice. I like it. I like it. <laughs> okay, so now for the planning part of this. Uh, so first off, it is New Year's Day. So I want to use this little sticker from Rose Color Days and it says Happy New Year. And... I'm just not sure if I want to use it, if it's going to fit on something like a quarter box like this. Okay, hold on. Let me try to get this off first. And I love that these stickers are clear. So there's not a white background on it or anything. I think it'll fit on something like this, a quarter box. Yeah. So let's this quarter box put down happy new year so pretty okay and then it is also my aunt's birthday so I want to use a half box for her birthday and I want to use a silver one. We might use a little washi in between. Just like so. I'm gonna put that washi a little too high up. Let me move it down a little bit. Okay, perfect. And then for my aunt's birthday, I completely forgot about Disney, guys. For my aunt's birthday, I'm going to use this little guy from Ohana Stories. I want to use this, the one that says, Happy B-Day. I'll just put him down here. And then I'm going to use this don't forget sticker and I'm going to put it up here on this checklist and these are from Rose Color Days because I have quite a few things that I cannot forget to do like put car gas in my car um, go to the grocery store and pick up some salads really quickly for the next work week the upcoming work week so I have like a few little errands to run once we get back from Disney hopefully we don't get back too late uh, so, like I said, one of them is gas in the car. So, we're going to put gas here. And then salads. So, go grocery shopping. Pick up a few salads. And then another one of them is to actually, my boyfriend needs to go pick up um, something from his place. And I'm just going to use this guy and put him on the side here. And it actually has to do with his mailbox that he has to go pick up something. So I put the little guy with the envelope. 
And then last but not least, we cannot forget, it is Disney. Disney Day. And I want to use a half full box for this, but I'm scared to cover up this clock. <laughs> so maybe we'll just use a quarter box. I don't know guys. Or maybe we should use this one for Disney. And then we'll put my Dia's birthday, my aunt's birthday, somewhere up there. Okay. I think I'm going to use this guy. Up here. I'm going to flip them around. So, let's put this guy here. So, that worked out. Make sure she's there because he's kind of lifting. And then for your Disney, put a little champagne glass here on Happy New Year's. That's cute. Okay. Disney, I want to use this little globe, even though it doesn't really have much to do with Disney. Um, I just think it's so cute. I haven't used it, so might as well use it. And it's one of the little freebies from. Once more with love. Okay, Monday is done, guys. Tuesday, Tuesday is back to work, and I have quite a bit of things to do for Tuesday, as in work related. Do, do we have a little checklist? Because I want to use this. I want to use these. Oh, here we are. We have little checklists here. So I'm going to do. Okay, I'm gonna put down a little header. And then I'm gonna set down this little quarter appointment label and then I'm going to use her and set her down this is from Fox and Cactus this little working girl so back to work I'm going to label that back to work and then I'm going to use another header that says here work Quite a bit, quite a bit of things to make sure I get done at work, and I'm gonna use this little checklist for work. Okay, so like I was saying, I want to use this little book here for the planner. Uh finish up that the rest of the week and I want to use here let me see if I can find those little headers where are my headers I mean my littles I was gonna use littles here we are okay so I'm gonna use littles and I'm just gonna use this little asterisk here and we're gonna put it right here So, that, and then have this guy, this little book here, and I'll know that that means to plan the rest of the week. 
as well as I'm going to put another little header, so glitter headers, and I need to note that I need to organize these stickers because I actually just bought, here let me put it a little bit more down, lower. I actually just bought um, some more binders for these sticker sheets and I want to make a note to organize them all. Right? But for that, I don't know which one I should use. Should we use a little box one? Or... I do have this guy from Scroll Prince Co. And this comes in a little freebies. And he's holding up stickers, so might as well use this guy. <laughs> okay. That side is done. For Thursday, not much is happening Thursday other than study and study and we have to make a little small purchase. I need to purchase a few more pillow shams. But I think study is the big thing here. So we'll use this little half box to note that we need to Study. I want to put a glitter. I want to put a header first. <laughs> header. And then we'll put this in the box. And then for that, I'm going to use this sticker and it has a lot of books and a little glasses so here we'll just put it on the side back to studying because I kind of stopped since it was the holidays and this is from my newest addiction and it's her little sampler Friday we actually start off with a bill due so I need to pay the cell phone on Friday the 5th and these are from Rose, Rose Color Days, and it is her little bill due quarter box. I love these stickers, so cute. Um, I think that is all I'm doing Friday. Oh, we forgot about the little purchase that I need to make. I'm gonna use this guy and. Either this or the money sign. We'll use the little money sign. And we'll put them up here. You can see that. Putting him right at the checklist. It is also payday on Wednesday. But it's fine. I don't need to make a note of it. I have it on my monthly calendar. Okay. So that is all that's happening Friday. It's just a bill due. How sad. And then Saturday, we actually need to hit the mall and return a coat that I purchased. And for that, I'm going to use one of the little appointment labels. Where are my appointment labels? Oh, here they are. So I'm going to put down a little glitter header. I'm going to set down this little point label. And then we'll do return of purchase. I don't know what to use to return purchase. Should we use this little shopping cart? Or should we use a little boxy? 
a little present. We'll use a little shopping cart, I guess, to return a purchase. Okay, and then from there, uh, that's all that's happening Saturday. Sunday, I just need to make sure to do an Instagram post again. So I want to use this guy. Put him up here. And we're going to use this blue little Polaroid from Square Prince Co. Stuff him right there. And... I also need to make a run to the grocery store, but since I just used, wow, I didn't think about it. I was going to use this guy for the little grocery store here. But since we don't have it, um, oh, we need to make sure to plan next week as well. So here, I have this guy from Squirrel Prince Co. Use a header in between. Let's put this guy down. I was thinking of putting him up here actually. Mm, it's fine. I'll just leave him here. next week here we'll use a little meal guy here to make sure to remember to purchase salads for the upcoming week for work so I purchased salads at Trader Joe's for my work week uh, I don't, I'm not 100% sure. I think I am going to set down the weekend banner, actually. Because I wasn't so sure about setting down this weekend banner. Or where to set it. I don't want to cover up too much. Maybe there, so we don't cover up the car and Christmas tree. You can always tell that's the Christmas tree. <laughs> Nice. I like it. Okay, one last thing is to just finish this little sidebar. So how I like finishing off the sidebar is setting down all these washies. So just complete it with all the washies. She always provides a good uh, set of washies that you can just stack and it looks like another full box, which I like. And they're different sizes as well, so we didn't really end up using any of her washi that she provides us with, which is okay. I mean, they look exactly like the full boxes, so. See, full, that's a full box, this is a full box, and this is the bottom washi, so. I didn't really need to use them. Okay guys, so I'm just gonna, I think I'm, I'm not sure if I want to put down any of this. These girls are beautiful. Should probably set down the girls. So I'm gonna use this little 
this girl, put her over here. Actually, yeah, I'm just gonna set her here. And I'm just gonna have to cut off some of her, her dress here. That's okay. And then I want to set another girl on the other side. So let's set her down. Hmm. Set her down over here. Okay. And then let's see, we have champagne bottle. Kind of like setting them in between the full boxes sometimes. This is a champagne bottle here. And then, yeah, some dots. dots on the sidebar somewhere uh, and then I have little stuff like this you can put it down there little wine champagne bottle Okay, it's gonna go there. A little clock. And then I don't have, I don't know what these are for. I guess you could do like this. Are these supposed to be like balloons? I'm not sure. I already set the champagne bottle. I should have put the champagne bottle down here somewhere. Okay, we'll put this guy here. I don't know. <laughs> okay guys, so this is how the finished bread looks. And just off the bat, I already know I'm going to love being in the Erin Condren for the rest of 2018. And I am surely looking forward to it. I hope you guys enjoyed and... Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, also don't forget to hit the notification button to get notified when I post up new videos every week, and I promise I'll be back on it this week, it's just with all the holidays and stuff and me getting sick, um, it was just very busy and I wasn't able to post up as much as I wanted to, but don't, I promise I'll be back on it, um, and I hope you guys enjoyed, I'll see you guys in my next video, bye guys!